Hello, this is Patrick Prevet at the Patrick. Today I'll be discussing the difference between the GMC um, 600 with the SBT 11 tube and the GMC 600 Plus with the um, LND 7317 tube, as well as showing off the reaction with uh, certain items and the lack of reaction with other items, which uh, emit activity. Here you can see that the uh, uh, the uh, black flat, black uh, what do you call it the black light I have uh, sort of what the radium does under it. The clock hand's really cool because it keeps going for a while. The RA disc will go for a little bit if I keep it on there. You know it still keeps going. Also interesting is the marble, which is a uh, I believe Vaseline glass, urinal acetate, and also not everything that's radioactive glows. This is a uh, Dorian mantle, and uh, here you have some DU 238. The 238 itself is interesting, but it's just sort of. Uh, Kind of looks like lead, but it's a lot. Uh, I'd say it's a uh, more brittle in its characteristics. And now to show off the sort of how these counters are a little bit different. First I'll show you what the uh, American tube sort of does, which is on uh, counts per minute. It has three modes, which is microsieverts and millireds, and the counts per minute, of course. And sort of show you something that's low radiation, which is this marble. And I've tested these things without the other things influencing their radiation, and it gets a very accurate test. Now, I'll show you this one. As you can see, the uh, reaction is rather slow with it because it's very low. It's nothing to worry about. But something that emits much more activity over here will show how much quicker these react and the sound difference. It goes really quiet, but it reads really quickly with the American tube. But at the same time, this counter is actually quite a bit heavier than the. Uh, Russian uh, counter, or the Russian, the counter with the Russian tube in it. So, it's kind of interesting how they have their own sort of unique noise when it reacts with it. This is probably my most active specimen, so I usually use it to stop activity. They'll read different, and uh, they'll take different times to get the reading, but they both do the, sort of the same thing. Counts per minute. Here's the millisiever. And uh, another one, probably. As you can see, it's quite hot, so I don't eat it all day. Then on other items I have, it's obviously much lower. The 238 is quite hot though. Another thing that's interesting on this one is you can see the uh, reaction on the Russian tube, which is really cool. Anyway, that concludes this video. This is Patrick. Thank you for watching. Spasiba. Uh, Paka. Bye.